this isn't your run-of-the-mill business. This is a $4.2 million strip club, which council members claim stripped them of their power. Larry Flint's sexy moneymaker, the Hustler Club, has just been given the green light to break ground in Lincoln Park right here on Papalus Drive near Outer Drive, despite the overwhelming amount of people against it. A mother whose underage daughter secretly stripped at a club and died of a drug overdose. I don't want another family to suffer what we've suffered. I don't want another child lost. Pastors who cater to the homeless and drug addicts. We fight with drugs and crime in this area enough already. Um, and this is basically going to increase it. Members of the Lincoln Park School Board. The strip club is an incubator for lust. You don't get satisfied. You're aroused even more. Then you become a predator on the street. And some council members who claim an agreement to settle a lawsuit and push the topless club forward was hatched behind their backs. We're entrusted with protecting the city of Lincoln Park and the people in it. And we're going to vote on this or it's not going to happen. But here's the thing. According to Mayor Frank Vaslow, council members already did. I have a paper trail that uh, I will gladly hand over to you that will clearly show that the council members knew exactly what they were doing. Here is that agreement, which shows on January 14th, the council met in closed session and unanimously agreed to settle the lawsuit. If the signs were subtle, the club would only be topless and this adult bookstore on the main drag in the city would close. That's just to name a few. It says right in the, the settlement agreement itself that we've read it and our attorneys have explained it to us and we've understand it and we understand it. That never happened. Ironically, Mayor Vaslow, who agreed on the settlement, isn't for the strip club. For the Hustler Club? Of course not. Nobody's ever for them. Then how can they come here if no one's for them? Because the Constitution says they can. So that old saying, you can't fight City Hall? Apparently you can if you're a strip club. We just feel that the city has been sold down the river. And because this Hustler Club is so controversial, we, t we are told that there's an effort possibly underway to recall some council members. Huel? All right. Now, Taryn, just so we're clear here, there's a lot of money involved, but the council does plan to fight this. Well, as hard as they can, Huel, we're told they asked a judge to overturn this agreement, claiming it was unauthorized. They've also hired a lawyer to look into what went wrong. We're live in Lincoln Park. Taryn Asher, Fox 2 News. All right, Taryn, thank you.